Welcome to All About the Bass. I'm Nathan. And I'm James. James, how you doing, man? I'm good. Uh, yeah, so what are we looking at in this edition, sir? We are looking at the Ibanez. The Ibanez? Ibanez. 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 E-H-B. Who knows how it's pronounced? Because it's a Japanese country, company, so they're probably pronounce it completely differently, right? Probably. It's probably I'm French. not going to attempt E-H-B. it because I'll probably get... Um, uh. Assassinations. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, Ibanez. Ibanez. Yes. EHB. They come in the 1000 series, which I'm holding. And okay. You, you've got the 1500. Okay. EHB, you reckon that was electric headless bass? It could be. That's because a, look. That's my best guess. Look at this. Look what's going on here. It looks like, look, it's like I've killed, killed him. Uh, they've, gone, they've gone for it. Look, they've whipped the head off. No head. All is not lost. You do not need double ball end strings for this, though, because look, you can just use regular strings. It's very handy. Allen key on the back. And then, uh, yeah, just, yeah. Your, just your normal just strings. Just lop them off. That's good, isn't it? Anyway, so you've got the 1000 series. 1000 series. Yes. Yeah. And I've got the 1500. 1500. How do they differ? Well, the, the, the most obvious uh, difference initially is the, is the choice of finishes. OK. Um, these obviously are one colour. Like um, solid, solid, solid finish, colour, right? Uh, there's a, a, f a few different options, whereas these have a, a, a poplar burl oh, on yeah. the top, which that's is very sexy, isn't it? Sort of bursty kind of thing. Oh yeah, that's nice. But yeah, it's very, very we can nice. see, a bit, see a little bit of grain through the back there. Um, but getting deeper into it, the, yep. um, the woods are different. This okay. is a this is a base wood. Okay. Or bass wood. Bass wood. Mm -hmm. uh, who knows? Uh, <laughs> the debate is open. I mean, it's a bass, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but so, it's the wood. So basswood it is then. Ba <laughs> Precisely. Yes, Yours, that's uh, basswood, basswood, yes. You, I believe, have a mahogany body. Well, that's very kind. Um, People are often... <laughs> <laughs> I never knew you cared this early in our relationship. No, you're yes. Yes, indeed. Mahogany. Solid. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, very yeah. solid. Yeah. Um, with, the, like I say, the poplar burl on top. Mm. Um, and the necks, so mine is a is a maple neck with with walnut. We counted Sounds five delicious. pieces. Sounds delicious. Roasted walnut. Yeah. Well, you you have the uh, the panga panga neck. Oh wow! Look at this. Which is panga, a nice, panga. a lovely dark chocolatey brown with walnut through it as well. Yeah, that's like a nine yeah. piece. There's many nine, many pieces. Many in pieces. There. Yeah, nice little satin yeah. finish. That's very nice. Yeah. Panga panga. Mm. It's not made from a pangolin, is it? I don't know. I hope not. I don't know what that is. Uh, but it's a very strange animal. <laughs> oh, I see. No, I think it's probably a tree. Oh, that's good. Yeah. That's all right then. Well, um, we, we don't need to worry. Okay. Uh, so that's uh, we got different so, yeah, necks. That's the uh, the uh, cosmetic differences. Okay. Um, you've also got these. These come with Bartolini pickups. Right. Um, whereas yours are the Nordstrand there. Oh right. Um, which are. Uh, Small American company right. from California, I believe. Okay. Um, Bartolini is that yeah, Italian? I mean, I guess Italian, Italian yeah. I'm not going to go too far into those, uh, you know, <laughs> no. national stereotypes. No, no. Well, I will. That's fine. That's yeah. my department. Probably that's, not that's Japanese. That's what I excel in that. Um. <laughs> I tell you mm. what. Why don't we show people how they sound? Right, because they, they both good? got the uh, they both got a, a three band EQ. Right. 
with a master volume and a blend pickup. Yeah. Blend, a pickup blend switch. Uh, Righty ho. So look, what we'll do, right, we're going to start off on the back pickup and then uh, I'll fiddle about with the EQ of that and we'll go to the front pickup and then we're going to go to both pickups and uh, we'll get a, a good idea of what this all sounds like. Great. Oh yeah, interesting point. In, when it's in kind of passive mode, um, the, 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 the bass and the mid uh, EQ uh, uh, tone controls don't do anything. The, the treble does work as a passive tone control, right? right? Okay. Yeah. So even in passive mode, you've still got some tone on there. Nice. And then kick the active in, and then you've got your proper active EQ, three band, uh, stack, treble and bass, and then parametric mid. Uh, I'll stop talking, you play the bass. Off you go! With a slide to finish, yeah. classic. Yeah, very nice. Hey, well, there's a lot of tones in there, right? Yeah, so it covers a lot of ground. It certainly. does cover yeah. a lot of ground. Yeah. Yeah, I have to say, we were talking about this earlier, but it, not having the headstock. Yeah. It's, it takes some adjusting, kind of getting used to where you're playing. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, doubly so with this one, I found because obviously you got the fan fret thing for mm. a start. But also, just with where the bass sits, the octave is is here, which which seems like a lot more that Definitely, way for yeah. me. Normally, you'd think it would be a bit more here. Yeah, so, so you kind of think you're... You think you're somewhere you're that you're not. Here, but actually, yeah. I know. 24 frets, so... That's Anderson's TV for you. You think you're somewhere, but you're, but you're not. not. Um, it's the Twilight Zone. <laughs> it's just, you were saying about the fan frets, because this actually comes both uh, both the... Uh, 1000 and the 1500 come with uh, a fan fret option on the five string. Okay. Um, they both come in a four string as well. Yep. San standard frets on a five, and then the uh, 1500 has a six string option also, which has fan frets. Oh, okay. So there you go. Six there. string. That's, yeah. that's cool. Yeah, because they're, they're very popular these days, the fan fret bases, uh, because they give you a, a much sort of tighter um, low B. Um, and that uh, obviously, for if you want to, you know, just it gives you a different scale length between this, the different strings. That's right. Yes, and, so and, and increases the tension. Exactly. On that one, on makes a lower it, string, makes it less flappy. Right. Right. So if you want to detune that even more, for instance, um, it doesn't really get crazy. Exactly. It should you know. keep a level of tension that's still nice to play. Yeah. So then um, you, you just have to get used a little bit yeah. to obviously the fact that the frets are a bit wacky, but just don't. Pay too much it looks to it. weirder than it feels. Yeah, I, I'd agree with that. No, yeah. I wouldn't say it looks weird, but it doesn't it, take too much. Adjustment. It looks like it's going, going to feel weird. Which it, okay. You know, yeah. Uh, then maybe because um, these have got the, the different pickups, uh, maybe we should have a quick look at this one. Sure. Yeah. Should yeah, we do yeah. that? <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, so you finished? <laughs> Good. <laughs> Are you yeah. Done. So yeah. Well, what do you think? Is there a broad palette of tones there, Absolutely, or what? Yeah. What are you thinking? I don't know how far you got with that. Yeah, Did you get through all the pickups and the all tones, the all the variations? Yeah, so yeah. yeah. I was having a fiddle. Yeah, so you good. That's what you've got to do. What you got to do? Well, there you go. Um, yeah, I wonder if it's. I wonder if they sound radically different to each other. Mm. The basses. What do you think? Because um, we've got different pickups and we've got different woods. Yeah, I think. I think uh, this one is quite a lot hotter. Really? Yeah. Should we do a quick A B yeah. just to test that out? Well, I'll put them through the same amp so there's no. Oh yeah, look, we got locking jacks. Locking jacks. That's a good feature. <laughs> it also. Uh, str uh, Shallow strap, strap, shallow strap locks. Shallow strap locks, okay. Um, and a gig bag. A gig bag? And you also get, which we don't have, a finger ramp. Which a you can, finger ramp? You can detach yourself so you can kind of feel like you're playing over the pickup. Right. Oh, what, like an insert well, that goes in here? Exactly. And you can rest yeah. your thumb on it? Exactly. Well, that's handy. Yeah, pretty handy. Right, here we go then. Quiet. It did actually, yeah. How is that possible? How is that possible? That's not possible, is it? Is that possible? Maybe uh, put the preamp in and let's uh, have a look. Let's leave put it, the pre. Okay, let's try. Flat. Let's try it that way around and see what this is. Right. So keep it flat. Preamp in. Right. Let's see what this baby does. Are we ready? I'm getting less bottom end on this one. Mm. That's interesting. It isn't is it? interesting. Now, what's that all about? Let's try this one. There we go. That's much there it better. Is. Yeah. Maybe the batteries are going flat on this Maybe one. Maybe the batteries are going flat. They must be, mustn't they? Mm. Definitely less output on mm. that. But this sounds very sexy. I like this one. Right, you're very tight, focused sort of sound on mm. that one. Give me that one again. Yeah, definitely brighter. Yeah. With these Nordstrom, is it Nordstrand? Nordstrand. Nordstrand. Nordstrand pickups. Definitely brighter. A little bit more focused, I think, maybe. Mm. Um, so yeah, so there's a difference right there. Sure. Uh, your pickups may be different material as well. Of course, we've got the uh, it was mahogany, isn't it? Yeah. So, uh, yeah, so they do sound different. They do. Um, yeah, so it, I guess it depends what sort of sound you're after, uh, you know. I have to say that they're very comfortable basses to, to play. They've got a lovely um, slanted back. Yeah. They sit lovely against your body. Well, they sure do. very light as well. And I think the idea apparently is with this, this um, body design is that um, it, it's kind of in the same position when you sit down as when you stand, if you've got a strap on it and you stand up, it kind of yeah. make, stays in place, right? That's the idea, yeah. Well, your turn. <laughs> you do. Well, I oh know, that's just that's my arm. I moving. like it, I like it. <laughs> oh, I think they look really good, man. I think they look really cool. They I do. love the shape. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Well, have we covered everything? All the bases? I think so, yeah. To excuse the pun. Mm, chambered. It's your chambered body? It's light. It's light. It's chambered. It is light, isn't it? They're really light yeah, bases. Very light. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Well, just to wrap up then. I mean, what's uh, what, what's one of these going to cost me? Uh, so they range from about nine hundred in the one thousand series for the four string. Okay. Up, up to about uh, fifteen hundred 
for the 1500 series. Okay. For the top of the range, which would be the six string, I think, with the fan frets. Okay, so let's say a four string um, in the 1000 series, about 899. About that. And then your six string, fan fret, all singing, all dancing, about 1500. About yeah? 1500. Okay, and yeah. then sort of everything in between, I guess, yeah. depending on whether you want four, five, six. You can six. find all the details fans, in the link below. Not fans. Uh, fantastic. Are you a fan of the fan fret? I am a fan. Are you? I'm a fan. Oh, I don't know if I'm a fan of the fan fret. Or you're not, not, you're not a fan I'm, of the fan fret. I do, actually. I do like it. I just enjoy the play on the uh, on the Fs. Yeah. I like all the Fs. FFS. <laughs> I think that's it, man. I think we're it. Shall we say goodbye? Ever finished. Uh, we're f -f 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 finished, so uh, you can all f -f 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 come back next time and, uh, and see us on All About the Bass. Hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, I've been Nathan. I've been James. We'll see you again. Bye. See you later. <laughs>